take me through what happened, because you saw this guy sleeping in the doorway of your bar this morning. What, what happened next? Did you instantly recognize him? No, around 9 o'clock in the morning, I went in front of my bar, and he was leaning towards the door, and the door was a little cracked, you know, the glass panel. So I uh, just went there and told him, I said, hey, buddy, you're going to get hurt. This door is cracked. So he just looked towards the door crack and I said, oh, I'm sorry, I'll, I'll move to the other side. So he was on the left side. Then he just removed his hoodie and just moved to the uh, right side of the building. So, and I just left because it was raining very hard. So, and I just uh, ran back to my store because I have a store just across the street from the bar. And that's the time when I saw his face when he removed his hoodie, it like, kind of struck me because I was watching CNN on my laptop and you guys have his uh, picture on a side like a PIP, you know, on a side. Right. So I said, this guy looked uh, similar, like very familiar to same, like the same guy, you know. And then I got a little busy in the store and then I was still wondering like, does he, is he the same guy? Is he the same guy? I'm just thinking. And then my friend, he's, he has a trucking, uh, repair shop, he came to my store, I said, his name is Winnie. I said, Winnie, did you saw that guy loitering around in the bar? He said, yeah. I said, look, look at this photo. I showed him the photo. I said, he looks exactly like this guy, but only the mustache, but he looks like him. I can recognize, like he's the same guy. He said, are you sure? I said, yes. He said, let's, I said, uh, then call the cops. So I was about to call 911. Then he said, no, I have the number for the Linden cops, so we should call them. And that's where I called the cops, you know. And and how quickly did, did the police arrive? Uh, because uh, I just, I didn't tell them that he's, this is a guy that you guys are looking for him. He's there. If I would have said that, maybe he would, they would have been there in a minute. But I just told them that the guy looks a little suspicious and you guys have to look. It, it doesn't look good to me. So she said, what do you mean by doesn't look good to you? Is he dead or alive? I said, no, no, he's alive, but he, he doesn't look good. Like, he's like... Uh, you guys have to send somebody to check it out, you know. So the, I think the cops came within five minutes and I was just waiting for the cops because by point, by that point of time, I was just like, it's keep occurring to me again and again, I, this is the guy, this is the guy, you know.